Hey, uh, wait! I'm really feeling it. Oh, it's fine. Don't look at that. I'm not getting chills or anything. Yeah. No the feelings. You need something real. Not me.
take a blow up doll, remodel the hole, and, and that's cheap. That's the infidelity. Hey, V. Thanks for showing. Talking with Michael is like a game of 3D chess. Don't let her derail you. Some deets about her could be useful when I talk to her, don't you think? No. Leave the talking to me. You seem a bundle of nerves. I have a mind to kill the bastards with my bare hands. So yeah, you could say I'm a teensy bit nervous. How do you aim to get her over to our side? By telling the truth. About Evelyn, what happened and why. You think that'll cut it? No. Have to improvise from there. I'm ready. Let's go. Hold on, I'll open it. A lock like that? No way you cracked it open on your first try. You know how to get around their systems? Appears so. I was hoping they hadn't run any updates since I left. Looks like I was right. Easy as pie, yeah. Follow me. Judy Alvarez. I'd say it's great to see you, but I've never been one to lie. Also, I never like surprise parties, but you know. Yup, but I even know why. Thought you'd hit rock bottom when you joined the mocks. Guess you've managed to stoop even lower now. Consorting with a persona who is very non grata. Yes, V. I mean you. Don't mind me. Just here to blend into the decor. That's no reason. Why come at all? To make sure Judy gets what she came for. Jude would have had a better chance without you. Judy has a proposal. About clouds. Wanna come back? Done. Always valued your skills, you know that. Just don't get why you had to drag this... loose end in here. Stop treating dolls like meat and I'll consider it. But first things first. Clouds needs to be taken from the Tiger Claws. Okay, look. It's clear what happened to Ev was... traumatic. Huh? I was convinced you didn't know. That girl was asking for an unhappy ending. I was just surprised it took so long. We gotta do something! Or everyone will end up like Evie! Woodman raped her while she was unconscious, then sold her like she was so much scrap. Yeesh, you've always been unstable. Okay, since you seem more reasonable, care to explain what this is about?
So? You aware what Woodman did to Evelyn when she was desperate for help? You sit by, let that happen? Tiger Claw bosses rule this place. Know how much I mean to them? About as much as you two and your problems mean to me. Read negligible. Doesn't it make you wonder why you even work here? Gonna pretend as if you two weren't ever here. For old time's sake, Judy. Literally moments from now, security's gonna figure out you're here. Got two options. Go out the way you came in, or get thrown out. And that's not a threat or figure of speech. Just a friendly heads up. Had enough. I'm leaving. Smart move. And, so you don't think I'm brushing you off completely, Forrest will be on the maintenance level in a couple minutes. Alone. I'm not your enemy here. And I didn't ask for your opinion. You picked the wrong side, Maiko. I'll be the judge of that. That went smoothly. She totally blew us off. Probably needs time to think. Couple of days, tops. And you might be right. I'll call her tomorrow. You have a history? Way back, yeah. I think I just felt lonely. Like everyone in Night City. She was different then. So was I. Can't trust people that see everything as a numbers game. Lying between patting you on the back as their friend and planning and knifing you as their enemy is down to a decimal. I know. Right there with you, I. Well, used to have a big crush on her. Took me a long time to realize who she really was. But still, honest or crooked, we need her. <sighs> Just think, could've gone diving this morning. A little unwinding do you good. Do me good too, actually. I wouldn't have been unwinding, not exactly. Got an idea buzzing in my head, working it, but can't say if it'll amount to anything. Yeah. You, a deck chair, and a Mai Tai with a cocktail umbrella? Somehow I don't see it. No. Me and the deck chair is me mulling over coulda, shoulda, wouldas. Something I avoid right now. Wait a sec. What about Woodman? Well, what do you want to do? I want somebody to unload lead into his face till there is no face. Somebody? Fine. Want you to do it. You sure he's gonna be there? You met Michael. If that prick still works here, it's cause he follows her orders pretty damn precisely. V, get it together. Innocent 
No point bothering about him. Bothering about him? Who knows how many people he's treated like Evelyn? How many more he has lined up? Just gonna let him get away with that? I don't want to kill him. Won't. Sorry, but... You can't ask that of me. Self-defense... That's... That's one thing. But execution? Judy... It's bad karma. You're right. Sorry. Uh, Punch the ground floor. Need to get out of this place. You know what's worse than a corpo? A wannabe corpo bitch. You mean my go? Piece of work, that one. But I'll give her credit. She's dead on about your chances of pulling this off. Even I don't change my mind that quickly. We've just received word on a breaking story. A Ken Tao AV has crashed outside of Night City. The aircraft's thrusters were deactivated. Fuck you two doing here? Where's Maiko? Why'd you fucking call me here? Evelyn's dead. Come here just to tell me that. It's fucking kind of you to remember. Here. Go light a candle. When Evelyn needed help, you raped her. Could have also broken her neck. Hung up her head like a chandelier till it started to rot. Instead, I took her to a ripper. Was due a little something in return. She should be grateful. And so should you. Hmm. Here's my token of gratitude. the ground floor to get out of this place. Almost felt like the world would be a better place once he died. And the feeling, it was so fucking strong. You know, revenge isn't ever really worth it. People want to believe it'll be the miracle pill for their grief. But that's not how it works. What's going on? It's nothing. Okay, except nothing I can do if you don't tell me. <laughs> Guess that's that. Oh, man. You're screwing with my head. There's that tone. Yelling comes easy. Taking me out somewhere. That fucking cord is on I am not yelling. You said yourself you got everything. I get back to Michael with something big. Appealing to her sense of justice wasn't big enough? Michael only works with specifics. For a minute there, thought you were about to call it quits. V, I go for days tuning virtues in a basement. Know what the chances are of somebody blowing my head off down there? Minuscule? Same as Michael's empathy. Unlike you, I don't put myself out there. But this ain't over. Not yet. You know, I'm also partial to specifics. 
Uh-huh. So that's what matters. How many you'll drop. How much ammo you'll use. How many eddies it'll get you. Art and dreams of freedom can't be everyone's food. Sometimes you gotta deal with the dirt. So, what now? Gotta think. We need more bodies, that's for sure. I'm gonna talk to the dolls. I'll call you when I've got something. See you later, V. And thanks.